And finally, from yours truly tonight, is it time to say goodbye to formal farewells? A new study has found that workers are shunning traditional sign-offs, especially in emails. It's thought some expressions could be extinct within years, but there is a crowd to whom it may concern. Our Midlands reporter, Pablo Taylor, now on the formal phrases being phased out. Dear Mr Taylor... In Donald Campbell's house, messages I'm are still sent writing. the old-fashioned way. As well as using pen and paper, he's also a big fan of traditional phrases like yours faithfully and yours sincerely. He is perhaps a product of his era. I'm very much a member of the old school. This is where I was brought up. And from a protocol point of view, when you're writing and addressing certain people, that you should still address them in that manner because it shows certain level of respect. But a new survey of 2,000 people suggests attitudes like that might be changing. Yours sincerely was described as old-fashioned by 37%, with regards viewed as formal by 46%. Even when it came to starting an email, almost one in 10 thought the phrase dear was boring, with 42% considering it friendlier to begin with higher. Hey. Are you going to be able to... And that more relaxed approach is very much the culture at this office in Birmingham. Most of the staff here are in their 20s and use instant messaging tools rather than traditional emails. So I'd say hey, hi at the start. Um, depending on who it is, I don't give much thought to the sign-off. I either just traditionally put many thanks and use the same every time um, or don't sign off at all and just rely on my email signature. But that, says one etiquette expert, might not always be the right approach. Sometimes actually you do need to add a little bit of formality to, to your communications, maybe because you're communicating about a very important, quite serious topic, or you may need to put a little bit of distance between you and the person you are writing to. Of course, strictly speaking, there is no right or wrong way of starting or signing off an email, and how you do it remains entirely up to you. Pablo Taylor, ITV News.